Hey guys, welcome to the Fight Age channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. Thanks for supporting me, guys. Shirley Finkel, manager of X World Heavyweight Champion Dante Wilder, say that their team is interested in a fight with British boxer Anthony Joshua. At some time, they're ready to organize it. Even if AJ loses to Ukrainian Alexander Usyk in their upcoming rematch which will take place on August 20th in Jeddah, Saudi Arabia. I'm sure this fight, Joshua vs Wilder, will be huge, even if he loses to Alexander Usyk again, Finkel told the Sun. Wilder has not entered the ring since November last year, when he lost by an account in a trilogy with the Korean WBC title holder Tyson Fury. The same Finkel believes that the Gypsy King will certainly return to boxing to fight, with the winner of the rematch Usyk Joshua since it will not be difficult for the promoters to find an amount that will satisfy Tyson. I don't meddle in other people's numbers or money, it's none of my business, but I heard that sheikhs from Saudi Arabia paid a bunch of greenbacks for Joshua to have a fight with Usyk there. I don't believe that the Joshua Usyk rematch is grander than Fury Usyk fight, and given that there will be four titles at stake at once, the Saudis should fit in. Who knows, draw a lot of components and variables, but one thing I know for sure. Now there are four big names, and these are Tyson Fury, Usyk Joshua and Dante Wilder. Two of them will fight this month, and this will clarify the future. The famous British boxer and commentator Tony Bellew admitted that he worries about the owner of the WBA, WBO and IBF heavyweight title Alexander Usyk in a rematch with Anthony Joshua as he believes that the former absolute world champion and cruiserweight will never become a real heavyweight. I'm actually worried about both of them. Anything can happen. Alexander Usyk will never be a real heavyweight and Anthony Joshua will always be like that. So every time Usyk meets a real heavyweight like Tyson Fury, Dante Wilder or Anthony Joshua, he will be in danger. Therefore, it will always be like this, but at some time, he is the most technical fighter in history. You can't argue with that. In terms of technology, Usyk is the best in the world. There is no one more technical. Tyson Fury is the best heavyweight in the world because of his attributes, size and what he can do. But now, technically, absolutely no one is able to surpass Usyk, Tony Bellew said. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please, subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 10,000 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying very hard absolutely every day and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks for supporting me, guys. Dimitri Salira, an American promoter, shared his opinion on the rematch between Alexander Usyk and Britain and Rachel Joshua. Usyk is the best fighter. I just don't know what AJ can make adjustments to win. Usyk is very experienced. He has made an amazing major career and is an Olympic gold medalist. He has been taught boxing stance since childhood, and he really knows this sport at the level of a scientist. He is a master of his craft, the most educated boxer in the world and perhaps of all time. He is very, very well educated in this direction. He doesn't take anything away from Joshua, he is great fighter and has done some amazing things in his career. But when he beat Klitschko, it was the peak of his career. After that, he gradually gave up in every fight. Age is a very gifted and hard-working fighter, but he has already done everything he could. Former world heavyweight champion Tony Bellew doesn't fully share the opinion of Derek Chisora who previously stated that Anthony Joshua in the rematch with Alexander Usyk cannot afford to lose on points. According to Bellew, if it really was so easy to strangle Usyk, then he himself or Murad Gassiev would have done it. I will agree to a certain extent, but it's not as easy as people think, just to pounce on Alexander Usyk. If that were the case, Murad Gassiev would have done it. I would do that. So, it's not that easy, but it gets a lot easier when you have the attributes of Anthony Joshua, so you have to use them. Just get in the ring and be a dog, but I can teach Joshua anything new. Use attributes that put you in an advantageous position, you have more than enough of them. Bill, you said. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.